Hey everyone, Sly47 here. Today I have some videos and some slides for you of the brand new tier 9 Italian battleship Giuseppe Verde coming to World of Warships Blitz. I know I slaughtered that, so I'm we'll fix that in the first little clip. Don't worry about it, okay? Don't worry. Got it. Okay? I just I just can't do it. I just can't. Okay. <laughs> but let me know your opinions after you watch all this video, what your opinions are, how it exactly goes. Gustave Verde for me, it's in a rough shape, but I think that's not because of it. It's more of because of the sap secondary. That's why I added in the slyance into this entire stream, because the more I played it, the more I realized that I would just like a better Napoli. Yes, please buff the Napoli again. <laughs> Thank you, Wargaming. Thank you for coming to my TED Talk. <laughs> <laughs> but let me know your opinions down below after seeing all of this and we'd love to hear are you thinking about getting it are you just going to collect it or are you going to be skipping on it until they change up the sap secondaries which i hope they do hope you have a great day peace hey sprocket how's it going how's it going we've got a gusape verde 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 i can't roll my i can't roll my eyes okay okay i'm, I'm just i'm i'm just gonna be blunt about this this is way too white to roll their tongue, okay? Just just how it's gonna work, okay? So we have the Gusape Verde. 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 Speaking of, we'll bring in the Funny. peanut gallery. Okay, just DT, say the Gusape Verde, but you actually roll it right. Okay. Giuseppe Verde. There we go, there we go. Giuseppe Got someone. Verde. Verde. Yep, it's 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 just like that. So uh, Gazapi Verde, let's quickly go through what it is. We've got, here's the historical camo details. We've got fuel smoke trace and like that. Are you? Cool. Are you on right now? Yeah, I'm on. I'm, the Discord, yep. Discord didn't give us notifications, bro. Bro. Well, the problem is if I post it up, literally the bot's going to post it up like a minute later. <laughs> oh, <laughs> we know what's going to happen. We know what's going to happen. Yep. Double ping, let's go. Yeah, no, right? Uh, we have a scout plane one, and we have a secondary overload dose. All right, there. We do have auto secondaries, but they are unfortunately sap auto secondaries, which if we learn from the Roma or the Napoli, Napoli, not, not the Roma, Napoli. Uh, yeah, um, not not very good. Uh, so my needs to be set after that. Yeah, <laughs> um, I have Campione on here. I am running. IFHE plus to see if maybe it helps just a little bit, uh, but I'd probably run APCS on this one. Uh, I am running additional smoke because that might help out night raid. You know, might might help might right, right guys, right? I can't believe, uh, I can't believe you're running an Italian DD commander. That's how sad this shit is. Problem. Uh, well, the problem is is Campione doesn't work on jack crap right now because this isn't needed on anything. Like night raid helps just a little bit, but it the doesn't. Only thing I, I would appreciate is the preheating plus for a DD. Otherwise, I would not need it for anything else. Yeah, I was just like, it's just not. There's no ship that Campione works on. That's it. Like, <laughs> it's just one of those ships. It's one of the worst things. Yeah, D oh, okay, we got it again. Good. I was just about to click <laughs> it. I was just about to Look who oh. Look oh. who the cat drug in. Let's go. Oh, hello, man. Okay. Nope. Let's go. That's Let's go. I see your A game. <laughs> um, in this, we'll see. We'll see. Because we got I, pasta I boat versus Roma. pasta boat. We'll find out. Face cam or Roma. Nope. Uh, I, I, like, I love all the Borgia, game. I how's it going? Rise and shine. It is going on night for me. All right. So what do we got here? This is with the full secondary spec. So we've got 7.24 uh, kilometers and main guns go up to 14.08. The scout plane one that should be about yeah, about 15.5, right? About that 15, 15, 16, 5. Yeah. Oh, that so. camo is so disgusting. What is that green? Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. You know, you can't fix everything. You can't it have it all. Like Marco Polo has decent camo, but that is just weird. Marco Polo is the better ship of this, and I wonder if this is becoming the... What's the... Uh, I can't even remember it because it's such a pile of crap. Um, with the the, the newer Friesland. The Groningen? Yeah, the Groningen, yeah. Well, to be Basically... Fair, the, Groningen can do a, the Groningen is just a slightly worse Friesland. That is a significant downgrade. <laughs> yeah, it does. Groningen at least can be... Might have been a little high, but... Hey, uh... Alright, let's open up with secondaries. The, once again, you, you are going to be deadly with your secondaries. They are 
gonna be powerful if they hit. Yeah, if they, if they, hit. yeah, it's it's one of those things. If you're gonna shoot like an FDG, hey, look, a carrier is shooting me. Hey, can I get some cover over here with the carrier? Wow, this thing is taking a lot of damage. Well, you know. Let's get behind this island real quick. Gonna roll roll. Roll. <laughs> Are we having a roll moment? Italian battleship gets taken up by Italian battleship. Surprise, surprise. <laughs> the accuracy on the, the ship. Not Nah, I need to probably shoot better. We'll, 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 we'll wait and see. Yeah, you, don't get that you don't get that juicy, precise aim, but I mean, no. it's still Marco Polo. Guys. Yeah. It's Marco Polo AP. I mean, you don't get sad, but you get that AP still. Um, Just so I can see better. What do we got here? Let's turn off. Point about it. The corner. Yeah, I know. That's what I was trying to do. Like that was like, respectful. Like that's a, you know that's what five out of five out of nine. It's still it's still you don't have sad. You still hit like a truck like Marco Polo. Yeah, but I think what's lucky is Grapes is doing something for me, which is perfect. But the problem with this ship is the secondaries don't really do well against battleships. Oh crap! I missed the front too. Oh, Razor is down damage. Get on eighteen dollars. Grapes is on damage. Razor. The driver is in the which gets raisins behind you. Sorry, dude. Get behind me. I'll cover you. We're going in. in front of you We're take going in. <laughs> yep. So, as you're going to see, the secondaries are going to get a lot of no damages. They're just not. Not pending green. You're not paying a roll. Yeah. That's just not, yeah, no, the auto sap secondaries aim for the belt armor, so you get a lot of hits on the belt, so. It was a G sap, now we're talking. Yeah. Not a G, it was a not sap, general. not sap. Not sap. Um, let's see, what do we got? Uh, Sexico, how's it going? Uh, Marco Polo is better, at, better, absolutely, Marco Polo is better, but Marco Polo is, Marco Polo's like, the Friesland. Or, you know, the, the Missouri or something like that. It's a better ship already at that, that tier. That ship is an extremely yeah. niche ship. That's, yeah. that's like the extremely that's one of the most extreme niche ships. And and we are we already have the Palmer and why would you why would you want a better secondary or the Prince Rupert, you know? It's just kind of the problem that yeah. the Napoli originally had now. But Napoli has Torp still, so the Napoli has other ways of doing damage. Yeah, so look let's the main problem with the why I say it's bad is that you don't have the Roma treatment on it, so basically it's not anywhere as strong. You have sap secondaries that aim for belt armor on battleships, so basically your sap secondaries do murder DDs really well. They do. But they are lackluster on anything else, and that's just not really worth it. And that's it's not a great trade-off. Uh, let alone you also are, as True Vet will say, you're tier 9. <laughs> <laughs> so you're getting a lot of tier 10 games, or you're getting a lot of tier 8 games, as we saw right here. We got uh, the entire wine crew with yeah, DZP yeah, Roma. Falling against the Roma, and the Roma's just bouncing your sap. Like your sap. All yeah, the secondaries yeah. are useless against battleships. Oh yeah, and that's that's kind of the, the trouble with sap secondaries. It's why the, the Napoli, it kind of works, but that's only because yeah, it also has torpedoes and great guns. Yeah, yeah, it has the, the torps, yeah, the Italian torps. Chef's kiss says Pig Bay would do. Most things are. Right, the dead. torps, you actually have another way of doing damage to battleships. Like, you need to give battleships. This thing, oh, yeah. screwed if you brawl a battleship at tier 10 or 9. <laughs> oh, yeah. And by the way, for anyone who's uh, wondering what, who we're watching right here, it's Red Gaming Dino. He also has a YouTube channel, a little meme channel over there. Go check him out, give him some love. I don't know that he'll be joining us for a few games tonight, and then probably joining us in ways to kill me. Also. <laughs> Because everyone does that. No, sometimes you gotta press it because, like, the Plymouth. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. Like, the Plymouth can hold its own if you bring out an OP team. Ship. Like, yeah, it's a good ship. So this one, sure. just just hold off stream snipers just a little bit longer, okay? Just, it's just a, it's a niche. It's a yeah. Niche. Or bring a bunch of brawling ships and we'll just have some fun, and I can show the extreme or, type of video. Or, or yeah. bring like a four DD game when you let's fly fun. <laughs> Exactly, yeah, you just let me just murder everything, because it, like it will do that, it will. 
Yeah. That's why I have fun with the sap. Oh, yeah, definitely. But, uh, Borgia, we need Captain Remark. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Carrier carrying us, DT. Yep. Thank you for the carry. DT's so. just farming grapes and raisins. <laughs> I mean, I went just damage farming. <laughs> Do a little bit of damage farming. A little bit. But 57, not bad overall off the bat. For, that's not too bad. I probably could have used also the fuel smoke a little bit more. I like that. So let's get a little bit more into this. See if we can work on this. So GG to the wine crew. Um, There's it. Oh my gosh, two black to cows. Next. Let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> oh, we're dead. A black to cow, best cow. Oh, not playing today. Yeah, yeah I get it. We're yeah. Maya. Maya can get thrown in the trash can now in the bin. Uh, no. To cow still. Like, the base to cow still works. Yeah, the, well, yeah. that's a premium, though. It's a premium to cow. Maya, get out of here. Yeah, you might have put in the black to cow, but. Yeah. Uh, Only one right, premium to cow option is black. Is the black. Is the words of glad black taco. Ooh, yeah. DT, do the funny fighter video thing. No, I'm gonna go after the bombers. Um, let's oh, no, let's see if I can play this a little better. No, no, you're gonna nuke something. <laughs> oh no, you find that jut loot. Oh no, you found the jut loot. Jutland, you're going straight. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> There's good Jutland's HP. Those three are up there, then that means. Actually, four. Yeah, three up there. We got one cruiser and two battleships down here. Perfect, let's go. Middle. I've seen the occasion leading the middle. The other one, middle. Gascan? Mm, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay stealth up. Oh, Let's there's see. the Discord ping. Discord finally pinged me like 20 minutes later. Oh, yeah. All the bot, uh, like even even Streamlabs multi-stream is just like I think Borgia messaged me like five minutes ago and, and it finally just showed up. On Wednesday, yeah. on Tuesday. I'll 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 re-log in. Like that's what I have a feeling it is. Let's get that off. Let's see. We got a monarch down below. That actually was a respectful hit right there. That was pretty good 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 accuracy. Uh, and, and if you are a brawling ship in tier 9, uh, you don't stop, you keep on going. <laughs> don't stop the train. That's, you know, the accuracy on this isn't that bad. Oh, thank you, Monarch. It's still gonna have pretty accurate guns overall. Turn on the way. Yeah, I know, right? Nope, not gonna launch my. And of course, you can't dodge. Sad part is that bombers. this ship, out of all the Italian battleships, is gonna be the worst one to set up because you have nothing to set it up with in the commander. Yeah, it's just. Commanders are built for this. Like, you're not gonna have a commander, you have to like, set up a whole new commander. For this ship. Almost within range. Because with with uh, secondary overload too, you want to wait. Let's do it now. Do it now. There we go. There's the secondaries. Yep. Yeah. Um. At actually at this range, this isn't bad. But they just they don't aim for the bow necessarily, so you might get some bow hits, but most of the main deck hits. I'm not gonna lie, this isn't as bad as I thought it would be. Like, they're still doing pretty decent damage there. It's still, I mean, it's still pen. It's not like HG, which is like only semi pen. Yeah. Like, like I said, if you fight tier 9, like FDG or GK, you are just your sap secondary and just throw it out the window. Well, against a, a Monarch, which is a tier 8. It did fairly so well, like, surprise, surprise. Yeah. Battleship. Well, I think the sap might be having a better arc, maybe, and that arc was able to do the damage. Well, yeah, the arc. Yeah, like, hilarious yeah. arcs the most. Yeah, which might the actually be kind of the saving grace, the but we need to do, we need to do more testing. Like a German battleship where you have actually you know what? I have an idea. Red Gaming, do you still have your Prince Ruprecht? <laughs> oh, oh, no. I just want to play Siegfried instead for brawling. I haven't played Siegfried in a while. Well, no, I was just wondering if you want to do a training room to see who wins, just secondaries only. <laughs> I know I'm probably going to lose, but playable or niche? Ooh. I think I want to say niche. It's it's a, it's a low niche, though. Yeah, it's a low niche. I agree with that. 
it is definitely playable because the guns they're they're, they're not insanely inaccurate like let's just try to hit uh dt right here i know it's a carrier but manual aim they're still pretty solid they're, it's still pretty good at mid-range you definitely are gonna be more fighting at the mid-range i just don't really feel like the armor though like i'm getting ripped apart by um uh carriers i'm getting ripped apart by monarchs like yeah i could heal up and maybe that might help oh no i was just about to pop uh that. oh my god it's a secondary ship boblin's in the chat everyone go give him some love as well awesome crater over there on the eu side i gotta go through and see that yep uh she's okay boblin she's okay rubric okay. yeah yeah secondary is only there no main gun. Yeah. Well, no, no, no. I think you actually might win it. Well, well, stop the music here. We get, we got we got some like clients to do with everyone. But I'm thinking with the fires, you might actually win. You know, because, just because it's the secondary brawl. You know, it's not it's not the same. I, and if you end up Are losing, you clearly, secondary or just all secondaries. Uh, just secondary. So you can use your secondaries as well. I don't. I only have auto secondaries. Oh, you do? Oh, well, then I guess I'm only using auto secondary. So we'll, this will be a great test. So roll up. Yeah, roll up on on there. Yep. Oh, my God. Slides. We're doing that. Yep. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm showing full broadside. Are you? Yep. You're shooting too. We're, we're just going ham on this one. Yep. Yep. I want to keep in mind that my elite bonus since Siegfried is the armor belt. Yeah, but it, as we watch this, this is this is this is where I want to watch because we're seeing these. Oh shoot! Sorry, that was my bad. My bad. Wrong one. Wrong one. I deserve that. Um, if you want to, you can shoot. Me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep. But as you can tell right here, these sap secondaries. Watch where they're landing specifically. We're getting about a fourth of those are specifically going for zero. You are right now with secondaries. Yeah, that's the thing. Is I'm starting. I'm. I'm wondering about this because if uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna use my auto secondaries so if i shoot at the water line with my secondaries i might have watch like you're gonna see one pen right there and that's really the problem with sap secondaries yep now even if i aim a little higher only that i'm still getting i'm still getting missed pens and this is the problem with sap secondaries is is they are not failing plus they have yeah they have no capability of setting a fire but get a little better at aiming and you aim at the right spot you can full pen sometimes that's once again you're running this by this by the way this does have sap plus on it so you are running this problem where this is the best case scenario and you're getting one full pen it uh blue or yeah blue would you mind shooting your uh or actually you don't have control of your secondaries damn it i always keep on forgetting about that siegfried um yeah because i uh when you're in your prince rubric on frontal like if you shoot at frontal areas of a ship you mostly get full pens or half pens my main secondaries yeah yeah the ap oh yeah you get full pens that's german ap Look yeah yeah so you're constantly getting those those full pens where but with even sap the secondaries on the roof you're gonna full pen a lot of times yeah worth that worth was a little better of a shot right there but you're, you're seeing this is at most of these shots i'm not doing much damage i'm at 300 something secondary hits and I'm at 35,000, like... Total fire with second you know, at, you know you're, you're seeing the problem, hopefully, everyone here. It, it's it's definitely, what's the main ammo on it? It is HE, you know, on that one, and then SAP for the secondary. Yep, so you can see, that's just a secondary, just raw fight. Um, if you've had a root rector or a in, you're screwed. Uh, which, do you want to quickly do that? A little more slides, everyone? Just one more, and then we'll go, go back to playing regular games, yep. Change that up. Start battle. Perfect. All right. So we're gonna do a little sec, you know, secondaries on a small lens to kind of show the kind of the extremes, and then um, Pig Bay with your Prince Rubric uh, brought the little crap out of me, and let's see who wins. How imbalanced the difference is, and it's just all auto secondaries. So, um, all right, Red, where are you at? Perfect. All right, I'm gonna start turning. Um, get ready to get Death yep. So one thing is, I just need to make sure that my secondaries get within range oh, of it all. Yep. There we go. There they go. They're open up and they're targeting the right person. So right there, you're getting just straight full pens. If you want to slow down there, uh, yeah. Look at that. They're just they're just chunking. 
Oh, not bad, not bad. What? Do you want a GK to test those again? <laughs> no, I think we're good. You're yep. a BB main. <laughs> yeah, so we, we can see here, like, if you just minorly second, uh, you know, my fire the secondaries, you are ripping apart a small one's gear. So, definitely good. Admiral Big Balls, how's it it's going? Fast process. Now, if you just saw right there, we did get a zero. We did not get a pen on one yeah, of those. On the small one's yeah, made. on the small one's belt. So, as you that can tell, sense, sap secondaries. Problem is that you have 90 millimeter auto speed. No pen. <laughs> Yeah, they they have Probably zero pen right there. Else. Another failure, but as you can yeah, tell, German this is secondaries are just better because they have bigger caliber second auto yeah. yeah, this is taking a while. This is taking a while. Okay, blue, thank you for being a test dummy. All right, so uh, pig bay. Oh, of course, pig bay is already starting off. Do we do we need this again? Do we need this again? Um. Oh, and actually, once again, test dummy right here. Perfect. The secondaries are focusing DT. And that's a lot of no pens. It's a ripple game. Yeah, I mean, against Battleship, don't even think about it. Yeah, yeah don't even don't cool. even think about it. All right, Pig Bay, Especially open up. Nine, Let's about. see if I can get this thing to stop. There we go. There we go. Now it's shooting. Yep. Uh, Pig Bay. Yep. We're gonna we're gonna see. And once again, Prince Rubric, just the amount of shells that it's pumping out. Two fires already. We actually are getting a good bit of pens here. Maybe from the angle? Also hitting superstructure to be very nice. Yeah, they are. And the, well, I, I wanted to do this test because the Schlieffen line does have some a bit of a problem. And what that is, is it has actually less armor than most. And as you can tell, we're just getting lit up and we're just not doing the fires and we're gonna lose to us. So. I was actually thinking the the Prussian. Um but um <laughs> Yo ho, how's it going? Yeah, but even when I fire the main uh, the main secondaries, I'm getting no pens if we fire at the front and such. Some pens. Let me actually get a little bit higher there. Yeah. So maybe with the main guns, let's just quickly while while I quickly die, let's just quickly fire a salvo, see how badly it does hurt the it does hurt the Prince Rupert. <laughs> The guns hit hard. The guns hit hard. But it's yeah, just sap secondaries. Yeah, those yeah. sap secondaries are not you they're not they're not a good call. You can't pen any high tier battleship. Yep. So Yeah, so. Yeah. I'll bring a well, DD. I'll bring a DD just to show off what it does against No, I think we we already kind of saw that with the the Fletcher in the first game. Um I think I think we should get back to games. That was some quick little slides everyone to kind of show off why SAP secondaries just and yeah, I mean, honestly, aren't if, for that. Like, if, if, if you want to know what your deciding factor is, sick it is you will a Siegfried BD in the secondary when you brawl, and that's just a cruiser. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So thank you, Pig that Bay, for you your about. time. I'll see you out there. Let's grab some people again. Slava will probably come in January, so that's when the Soviet battleships came out. No, I could see that coming for Christmas, just like the Bergamia no, no, no. came out. Christmas. Just like the Bergamia, yeah. I see Christmas. Yeah, Christmas. I think I said what? New point, two tier ten. Point zero one percent uh, chance. That's what's gonna happen. Point zero one percent. I'm calling it now. Calling it now. <laughs> oh. We have the ultimate like just delete team with our big guns. <laughs> yeah, just a little bit. <clears throat> Double Musashi against these two raids. <laughs> <laughs> That's... Double Musashi against two raid battles. And it's Black Taco. Yeah, and just two black to cows. Yeah. Alright, let's move. It was nice knowing it was two black to cows. Alright, I guess I'll go south. Yeah, pretty much. But we're all down south, everyone. The entire IG the camo is very is... interesting. What don't I like about it? It's a tier 9 brawler, and the problem is is the Prince Rupert exists, the Pomeran exists. The Marco Polo Free exists. <laughs> um, oh, the Frederick probably outdoes it in secondaries as well. Yeah, the Frederick has, um, again, it has those German secondaries. Yeah, That's it's. Funny. Oh. No, you it's, go, go it ahead. Has you go. The Italian 406s, which are have armor that functions. Yeah. yeah. It doesn't really have the best armor, too. Like, I feel like I'm constantly getting nailed. Like, I don't feel like this but holds you know, up. You, this is, you don't have the precise same, you can't sit at max range goal. Yeah, but you know, of course, you got scout plane, which of course needs scout to plane. be added to, uh, to a commander skill. It is going to be really nice killing DDs. 
that actually was pretty good accuracy right there, but Scout Plane, I swear, you know, adds could, a little You post. could run a Napoli with a, uh, Zeppi Ved... <laughs> Run I just this. rather run more Napoli's. Like Napoli's already like good in its niche. It's not yeah. insanely good in its niche, but let's see. Yeah, Napoli, I... Again, we're gonna bring it back to the fact that Napoli has torps. <laughs> yeah, the Napoli has torps and really good guns. And Napoli can at least the torps can help you with the battle. Are there so it's... many things that have big guns? Uh, Cure Sarge exists. Yes, if you like Cure Sarge. Sarge is exists, already, it's technically yeah, a better but... brawler because you can aim secondaries yeah. with HE. Oh yeah, I can see that, but uh, no, it's just the the problem is like, what what are you here for? Like, what uh, what benefits do you bring your team? team? Uh, it's why not like it's not it's, it's, it's not it's bad not though. Bad either. That's the problem. It's like good but not bad. Well, the problem is like yeah, it's it's competition immediately removes it from being good. Yes, yeah, pig bait Those absolutely. Sap secondaries are meh. And by the way, everyone, I'm going to try figuring out what the crap is going with Streamlabs because it seems like the chat isn't coming up when I see it. So I literally actually have to have like four tabs open on the side. That's why I'm reading over here, not over here. So, oh crap, sorry, I got to pay attention. Where did right. Musashi go? I had backup. Where did he go? Without me, we're going to do epic flanking maneuvers. This is a poor man's Marco Polo. Yes, just like the Gronigan yeah, yeah, is guy, the poor man's Polo, race. This is the closest thing you get to Marco Polo. Oh, I don't I think I don't think you can compare Groningen to it, because Groningen is at least like can actually pump out good damage. It's, like, I... it's actually just like a niche. Yeah, that is niche true. That is true. It's not a bad I'm not gonna say it's a better Friesland, but that's pretty crazy. You know, Groningen, if you know what you're doing, is gonna pump a lot more damage than whatever you're playing right now. You got that Amagi? That is true. Yeah, I got the Amagi, yeah. Wow, first strike with three minutes in there. Uh, I just got out of brawled by Bitcoin. Yeah, I think I might just clip this Wait, entire I thing. Over. Right. When, when I, I it love... reverses, the, the auto secondaries actually hit the bow section. Really? It's... Yeah, I'm just... I, I watching the stream and I saw that with the Amagi, the auto secondaries are actually going in the bow. Oh, that's because it was backing up. Yeah, that's. That's what I was saying, like, reverse I mean, no, actually helps you. Again, if you find like a, like a Kremlin or a GK that has good bow armor, forget about it. Yeah, god forbid it's the Kremlin's running its mod, too. If it was already legendary mod, then you can put it in the Yeah, just forget about you it. Just use the main build and just brawl with main build alone. Yep, Anyone's, this is still a tier 9, I'm gonna kill tier 8. You can still make it work. Um, it's gonna hurt. Yeah, right there. That that definitely hurts. And let's just open up secondaries again. He's backing up, so you're gonna see I'm getting full pens on the bow. That's not bad. And of course, you get with the. This might be so far. Yeah, this is definitely a collector ship. It's not. In... Okay, so no, so don't reverse. <laughs> yeah, don't reverse, or maybe you can go forward. I don't know. Love to test it out. <laughs> More slants. Um. Most of your damage is true main guns. Like your secondaries are utterly useless for damage. Yeah, we'll we'll check after this match because I have, I definitely feel like I've hit a bunch, but the secondaries are. Ooh, Benson, Benson. Hi, buddy. Witness the full power of this fully operational battle bruiser. I'm kidding. No, not really. Please, 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 please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. I've been doing so good so far. I've been actually having a good game. There we go, perfect. But well, that's because your main guns are just wrecking everything. Like, I know, right? Guns. It's still a Marco Polo main gun. Like, it's still yeah, good. It's, it's, that's why it's a poor man's Marco Polo. If you yeah. want a Marco Polo without, like, gambling your life away for it, this is a ship. Yeah. Well, if the Marco Polo ever shows up again. That's the other thing. Marco but, Polo is not going to show up. There is no way. Yeah, no, it's... If it does, it's going to be, like, some crazy present. <laughs> oh, no, no, this is so sad. My Yamato got his paint scratched. That's so sad. <laughs> uh, now let's let's go up against. I got a brawling ship. Oh, we're gonna win. Who capped? Who capped? I was about to go against the best brawler, and we got an MVP finally after was that four games? How much damage you will gain guns? Because you must have done nothing yeah. in the second. Oh yeah, pretty much. I'll, let, let's see. Let's see this. So not too bad, not too bad of a game. I did eleven thousand damage in the secondaries with 
92 hits. Oh, just give it normal battleship reload and this thing's fine. Yeah. It doesn't help that the the, like, the it's, you get the secondary reload option specialization or the advanced turret. If it EGO, yeah, you just go EGO. But you instead you just do you, you do this, you, boom, 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 and you go for Marco Polo. <laughs> you just wail like it's. I think it'd be better put out for Marco Polo. Um, let's just quickly go over tier nine battleships. Uh, I actually would want to say the the Marlboro might overall be kind of better because just because of the sixteen guns. Um, Missouri is better to go for. Uh, don't go for Eisen. Don't go for that. Uh, better. Prince Rupert. Yeah, Prince Rupert. Palmerin would be better. Uh, Black FDG is pretty good. Uh, the oh, Alsace is just amazing. The Lepanto is absolutely, in, you know, still strong. And Marco Polo is just a tier you have, stab, you, have, you have stab gun. You can, yeah, you can, still you do. Uh, even if we compare, I think someone did ask, ask for this, so let me actually make sure we add that to the list. And we go over to Kasape and add to the list because it's something on this. So. The Soyuz has longer. nearly indestructible turrets now. It's pretty fine though. Oh, I bet it, I'm betting. Um, but as you can tell, well, it's got a very a little more health, top, a little top, faster. Top, but no, but <laughs> yep. Um, range is better on the Lepanto by damn it. Uh, turret traverse is better on the Gasapi. Makes sense. You, you got much bigger ones right there. But the guns, you you've got HE and you know sap on the secondaries. Um, you have uh, auto secondaries. Or you got HE, sorry, you have HE on this one, Sap on these, on Gusape Verde, but we saw the Saps just don't do as well. Also, Lepanto's a little sneakier, so you can run it more like a battle cruiser and do that. Are you saying you're, better are you telling me that the Sap does two more damage than the HE? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> That's so funny. That is. Oh, yeah, that does. That is so sad. That's so sad. Yeah, so. That. Personally, this is this is a skip ship. This is if you want a niche ship, this is definitely niche at the tier. But once again, there are better ships at brawling, and we even saw earlier there are better cruiser brawlers than I this want, I don't ship. Even want to know what a, I don't even want to know what an Azure would have done to that. Yeah, an Azure <laughs> would probably rip it apart, and that says something because the Azure and the Siegfried are like the, I'd, I'd say Siegfried's better than Azure. Uh, overall, yeah, but <laughs> yeah, I can tell you that. Much. Yep, you're having that. Uh, you know, maybe even the Carnot secondaries would be absolutely hilarious. Get it? But yeah, just, just I, I'd stay away. And I.